So we're taking a look at MSDI. It's up 2%. 100% today. What is going on with the stock? Does it still have the power to go up bigger on Wednesday? I think so. Stay tuned. So looking here at MSDI, this is the daily chart. We're looking back at the previous month, seeing what's going on with MSDI. What's the news? What's going on? Why is it running up so big today? It ran up from 40 cents up to $1.46 there after hours. Closing strong there at $1.46. This thing is on fire. It's up 200 pre sent on the day this thing it's going crazy i i'm sorry for my excitement but this one's got serious potential and the reason that i say that is there's a reverse merger going on people were talking about what's the chart look like what's going on where's the resistance going on with the chart where is this going to go well the problem is now that there's a reverse merger deal happening none of this past chart means anything obviously you know two dollars is going to be a resistance area because it's mentally resistance but i feel like overall this news today has changed everything with MSDI, and there's a big possibility this thing is going to run. It's going to run up huge on Wednesday, and the reason I say that is you look at the volume today. Only 7.8 million shares traded, and that's just the beginning. There's a good possibility we're going to get double, triple the volume on Wednesday once we have a full day. Today was a half day. A lot of people were on vacation. A lot of people did not trade today, and MSDI, the news is just now getting out there into the world, so everybody is going to be keeping an eye on MSDI Wednesday morning, looking for pre-market to gap up. We got resistance previously at the $1.68 area, and then $2 area is going to be resistance as well because it's previous you know, mental resistance there at $2. And then I'm looking at that 240 area and then possibly 295. It really just depends how crazy this one gets, how much news this one has, how many people want to short this, how many people just want to risk and fight. And it was a pretty good setup here. It's got a great possibility to want to run. This is a reverse merger it's going to merge with another company it's going to merge the two companies together at the end of this year and there's a big possibility this one is going to run up huge and really make some big moves on wednesday keep an eye on msdi you can see here this is where we're looking you know 168 two dollars 241 as the future resistance and then looking at the daily chart you can see here it jumped up there to a dollar dollar smacked it down and it held that resistance all day long look at this literally at 95 cents bounce off that 95 cents for most of the day there into the end of day and then right before end of day we jumped up there to a dollar we jumped up there to a dollar 35 pulled back there into close but still a strong spike a lot of volume going into close there you can see the volume just quadrupling there into close and then here running up to a dollar 49 after hour so we got a move from a dollar 20 up to a dollar 49 like a 20 30 percent move there after hour so big move on msdi day it's up huge up 200 percent on the day and i think this is really just going to be the first day of the move looking at wednesday the first real day this week the second day of trading in july see this one if the volume is there if the momentum is there this one is going to run so keep an eye on it i'm swinging it over the holiday i'm going to look for some moves wednesday morning pre-market to see if we can get a spike up to that two dollar area we'll see what happens stay tuned but if you have a chance take a look at msdi and keep this one on your watch list for Wednesday morning, up 200% today. Crazy small cap mover here. Big news this morning for this company. So really the sky's the limit at this point. I can see two, three dollars, no problem if this really wants to get going out and going crazy. A lot of trading after hours, like 300, 400,000 shares traded. So still a lot of momentum going into the end of the day here. And we'll see what happens Wednesday morning, so stay tuned.